Hi, Chris. Mark Crossley here. Um, it's a pleasure to uh, be leaving you this message. Uh, Spurs and Forest have had some uh, unbelievable battles over the season. Uh, cup games, league games, cup finals. So, thoughts on Forest this season? Um, Forest have been very inconsistent. Uh, one stat that is interesting is that only lost three games at home in the last 21. Uh, so, the stats um, are, are not too bad at home. Away form is not great. But obviously, uh, so it'll be a tough game. They're always tough games, Forest against Spurs, whether they're at home or away. Um, thoughts on Postecoglou this season? What a breath of fresh air. Absolutely love listening to him. Love his interviews. Love the way his teams play. And I think Spurs have been absolutely top draw this season, uh, especially without Harry Kane. Uh, Brendan Johnson, what an unbelievable talent, uh, a great signing, uh, one for the future, most certainly. Quick, got pace, very confident young man um, and going to be a top, top player. So on Friday night, uh, probably going to be very cagey from a Forest point of view. We'll probably sit back uh, and try to uh, attack on the counter because we know that how well Spurs can keep the ball and how dangerous they are going forward. So I might sound a little bit biased here, but I'm going to go for a 1-1 draw. I think Forrest uh, might nick one on the break and, and try and hold out at the end. And just as you look in there, there's a little shirt there. Shirt I wore in the FA Cup final in 91 when I saved Gary Lanika's penalty. But it was a 2-1 win for Spurs. All the best. Take care.